Welcome back kings and queens. It's been a while since my last update, about two weeks I'm going to say. Um, but besides that I've been grinding away. I hit C32. Um, this new update's really awesome. We're going to talk a lot about that today. Um, but besides that I'm running out of content to post. So if you have any ideas go ahead and post them in the comments below. If you want any type of walkthrough or anything like that. But being inside of a nap only kingdom. It limits me on any type of burn videos minus my one kingdom vs kingdom fight every two weeks um this new event that's supposed to be posting soon which is not here yet i'm gonna guess it's gonna come after this kingdom events ends so another one day five hours um i might be able to get some, some good content from that also so we'll just have to wait and see um but besides that let's get talking about this 1.9 it's probably the best update that there's been to this game today um first thing you should do is go ahead and get this splendor gear um, it's a hundred percent better than your opulence gear so as you can see so that would be the first thing I get so and I'll show you the how big of a difference it makes from like going from C32 to C33 like I have it equipped right now We'll hit upgrade. As you can see, we need 288 million food, like 17 million iron, or 17 million silver, 34 million iron. Now we'll go ahead and change the gear back to the opulence gear. We hit upgrade. 332 million food so 50 million food you save right around 20 million iron so, or silver so you're saving 4 million silver and right around 40 million iron so you're saving around 5 million iron I mean so it's a it's a big difference so that'd be the first thing I get um, what else is new in here we got the airship the mercenary airship it's expensive as hell um, for one day is twenty dollars. For seven days is one hundred dollars, and this is just one airship. So if you want to have four, it's going to cost you four hundred dollars a week. Um, I will be purchasing this on Kingdom vs Kingdoms, um, just because if you're holding the tower or holding a palace, um, you can attack then with your airship. So it has a major difference. So it helps a lot so I will be getting it during Kingdom vs Kingdom and events but besides that I will not be using it to farm with at all I mean it'd be nice to farm with it but not at that price what else is new they fixed the stores so now you can get to all three of your stores from one area you can go to catacombs trader your mining loot your expedition shop so they added Juicet in here um, in the mining, they added they added a second Aristocat badge, so you got one there and one there, so you get a total of 12 a day. Catacombs Trader, I'm not sure what they did. I'm thinking they adjusted the resources some, but I'm not quite sure. I don't really buy resources here, so I can't tell you. Um, we got new guards, which I'm working on getting a few of them leveled up. They do sell XP packs now, so it'll make it easier, but I just haven't been concentrating on them. But I have so far I have Dominique. I have uh, Valor, I think, or Volatar. And is there? No, Constance isn't. I thought I had another chick. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I got pieces of my last one. Um, there's also another one that you can buy with only frags. Let's see if I can find it. Um, the packs did change. As you can see, Aristocat badges. Now you're getting 340. So they doubled their Aristocat badge packs. Um, 
each you know, like your harvest pack, your timber pack, your silver pack, they all um, got about a 30% increase. Your airship power packs are really good increase. Um, it's a 100% increase also. You gained, um, now you can get 13.5 million XP per pack. Gemstones, you got the same shitty drop rate. Iron got it upgrade, silver got its upgrade. Where is this? I didn't notice anything in the alliance pack. Nothing changed in there. Oh, we got the vengeance pack. I totally forgot about this. This is pretty cool. Um, it says for eight hours, any lord who attacks your estate will have a wait period imposed before they can activate a peace shield. There's a 10 second warm up before the vengeance alert takes effect. So I'm guessing you can attack, and as long as you bubble within 10 seconds, you're actually safe. So I'm not quite sure about that. I mean, but if they don't speed recall or port away and bubble, you might, that might be kind of awesome. I'm going to buy a few of them for my alliance and see what they do. But that was pretty cool. But back where I was going, trying to find this new guard. Guard pack? Must have passed it. Oh, it's in here, I think. Alright, here. Captain Treville. So he's cavalry health, infantry defense, cavalry attack, troop attack, and troop health. <clears throat> it's a pretty good card. Um, but you need 20 fragments. And I don't see where to get their fragments anywhere besides here. So, that's... 20 or two packs to get them so and this is your guard XP so I'd assume you'd be seeing a lot of him coming around pretty shortly since you get 10 10 frags each time you purchase the XP and I need to start working on my guards because I really haven't done much to my guards um, what else is new The new event's not out yet. Um, we have the Oplins gear, or the Splendor gear. I think that's about it on this. Yeah, we did the Mercenary, the new guards. Oh, we got C40s now. That's nice. Um, which made C-35 a lot cheaper, so I should be able to get the C-35 here pretty quick. Faster than I was gonna reach it before, so that's nice. Still a long, 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 long ways even away from C-40, but I'll try to get C-36 just because I like the way the castle looks. The castle's pretty OP. Um, I don't know if, I don't know if Avepox went to C-36 yet, let's see. We'll luck out if he's pushed and we can see the new castle. I gotta find him. I don't know where he is. He's not in his hive. Yes, yeah, so I don't know where APOC is right now. Oh, there he is. Shit. Okay, there's our pack. <clears throat> so, yeah, he's a C-37 right now. That is a pretty OP castle. So, it's got some smoke coming around it. Gargoyle. I don't think the C-36 has the smoke right here. But, yeah, that's, that's what your C-36, C-37 will look like. What else do we got? I think that might be it now. We got the new update, which I'm thinking won't we'll post for another day. The mercenary airship. Oh, we got the new deal of the days. Oh, and the auction house. So the new deal of the days is a 99 cent pack. So, I mean, it's pretty decent, I guess, for 
like if you're just starting out or maybe for a farm account um but this is pretty nice i mean your chance of these i mean only medium everything else is low and then very low so that's what you get with that your normal mega deals ultra deals royal deals they didn't change at all at least not today's we also had the auction house which they are now selling the new creation gear in there let's we'll see if they actually have one in here while I'm talking about it no they do not so here I'll show you here there we go we got the enforcers as you can see they're not going for that much for the blueprints enforcers executioner so <clears throat> you don't have to spend twenty dollars per blueprint anymore now you can spend it's looking like the average is like fifteen thousand gold so you can probably get them for right around 10 if you can catch them at the right time i mean they go up to 18 19 14 16 12 13 actually so 12 to 13 if you can get them around there it seems cheap 15 seems about average paying over 16 is probably going to be high but I noticed that in here and in the black market they're also selling them and they're going for a little bit cheaper in the black market Wait, here's the executioner shield that's what I use as executioner here Um, but some of them are going for a lot more 20 12 15 8 oh, so there's a good one too I mean so your best bet would probably be getting them in here and just making them low bids and just keep an eye out on and if you get lucky you can get them really 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 cheap um, but besides that guys uh, make sure to hit that like and sub button once this new event comes out, I'll go ahead and do a video on that. And if you have any ideas, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. And I have no problem making a video on it. All right, guys. Until the next video. Later.